What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Off-Road Outlaws. In today's video, we're going to be showing you how I got the prototype Ford Bronco. So I'm going to pop up a picture right here on the screen. And as you can see here, this Ford Bronco, this is the prototype and it's got the white all over. It looks like it has those circles all over it. And then it's got that basically cover over the back of it. It's sort of like a giant foamy looking cover and everything around it is basically like a wrap just to hide the car so that way you know whenever they're out testing it the people can't really take photos of what it truly looks like so what we went ahead and did is we actually built that prototype one over here and this is as close as i could get to it obviously the circles aren't exactly how it is but i mean it looks decent i wish i would have been able to cover the front of it the grill and the headlights and all that stuff that would have been cool and as you can see here, the wheels, they're obviously not the exact same wheels as the one on the prototype. But let's go ahead and go to customize here. Let's go to rims. Now, I was going to choose these wheels right here. These would have been good. But the only downfall to these is they have the bead lock on it. If it didn't have the bead lock, I would have definitely went with those. So guys, let me know down below in the comments what your thoughts are of this prototype Bronco. Honestly, I think this looks kind of cool compared to a normal Bronco in here. It kind of does look like a prototype. So we're going to go ahead and bring this thing out. And it is a stock vehicle, so we're just going to go to a map for stock vehicles. So I'll meet you guys at the map. Now the map we went ahead and chose for today is called Moose Camp Trails. It is a map made by me and I actually made this map a long time ago. Now this vehicle is completely stock, no gear ratio, tuning, none of that. So let's hope this can at least get up some stuff because I know it's going to be down on power big time. But look at that, we're already sort of stuck on this. Two very boring minutes later. Okay, let's see, how fast does this thing go? Let's go ahead and turn off diff locks and let's see what we can reach. Is this faster than that lowered truck? I think it might be, no. Okay, that squatted truck is a little bit faster than this. I can't wait for Whistling Diesel to destroy it. Okay, so the first spot we're gonna go to right here is actually this right section. This one is a little bit easier than the left. So let's go ahead and kind of make our way up here. Now, when they did the testing, they actually did it with, you know, a different vehicle. Whenever they did like the off-road testing, it wasn't the exact prototype they actually use the real version of it okay looks like this thing is not gonna make it up this not everything can get up it if you do get stuck right here you're pretty much stuck between the tree so good luck with that so i'm gonna go ahead and pop up a video right here on the screen of whenever they were testing these Perfect. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and bring this over here to like the first mud pit section. Let's see if we can at least maneuver our way between it. Now, I would expect this vehicle to be pretty decent for a stock vehicle if I change the gear ratios because it's just about the same size as the Jeep and this is actually the Jeep Wrangler's competitor. I don't know if any of y'all knew that, but that's why they made the Bronco. Oh, come on, come on. Definitely don't want to drown this thing in the water. Come on, come on, come on. We got this, we got this. Can I turn through? Can I turn through? Now keep in mind this does have slick tires on it, it has the street tires because this is the prototype version. I would not expect the prototype one to be extremely good at off-roading just because of the tires. Bay, hey, I mean it's doing pretty good so far, I actually kind of like it. Alright, let's see, can we make it up and around this corner? A lot of vehicles will struggle here going up and around this corner. And looks like this one might be struggling. Come on, let's get it, let's get it. 
No, it's sliding down. Oh, oh, I thought I could get it, but apparently not. I am not doing too well. <laughs> so we're just gonna turn over here to the left. Can we go up and over where these logs are? I do not think we can do that. Nope, we are officially stuck. Well guys, let me know down below in the comments what your thoughts are about the prototype Bronco, the 2021 prototype. Oh, and it just cleaned itself. Well, besides that guys, let me know down below in the comments what you think about my build version of it. How close do you think I got to a rated out of a 1 out of 10? Besides that, please be sure to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications.